What's up bros and welcome. Now today I'm going to be showing some LEGO Breaking Bad customs that I've made, so let's get down to business. Now for the first custom in today's video, we have Walter White. Now, the legs of this Ghosto minifigure are from a casual Coco minifigure from the Lego Ninjago movie minifigure series blind bags. Except, I replaced the upper crotch piece with a printless brown piece because originally there was some printing on there and that's definitely not accurate to Walter. Then, we're gonna take this Aldrich Killian torso piece from Iron Man 3. And then for the last piece, we're of course going to take a Commissioner Gordon headpiece and pop that on. And then we have the completed Walter White custom. Now, I've wanted to make a Breaking Bad customs video for over a year at this point, but the one piece that I was missing that I really needed was the Commissioner Gordon head so that I could make a proper accurate Walter White custom and recently I did get my hands on a Commissioner Gordon head piece because I got it for pretty cheap in like a Mercari along with a Blue Beetle minifigure but that's besides the point. Here we have an accurate Walter White custom, probably just like a very simple custom but it does get the job done so yeah that's basically it for this custom. Now for the second custom in today's video we have Jesse Pinkman. Now, the legs of this ghost or minifigure are from LEGO City, I believe. Then, we're gonna take this yellow jacket torso piece, which is from a Monkey Kid minifigure from the LEGO Monkey Kid sets, of course. Then, we're gonna take this random headpiece, which I believe is from Prince of Persia, so pop that on. Then, we're going to take this dark grey beanie piece, pop that on, and then we have the completed Jesse Pinkman custom. Now for this Jesse custom here, I decided to base it off of Jesse's design from like season 1 where he had like the beanie and he had like a yellow jacket and stuff, so. And I gotta say, Jesse Pinkman is one of my favorite fictional characters of all time. He's a go, he's precious, but... Yeah, that's basically it for this custom. Now for the third custom in today's video, we have Hank Schrader. Now, the legs of this custom minifigure are from a casual Cole minifigure from the Lego Ninjago movie minifigure series blind bags. Then, we're gonna take this torso piece, which is from Lego Dreams, and of course, we also have some brown arms and some random hands attached. Then, we're gonna take this headpiece, which is from Captain America, I think. Pop that on. And then we have the completed Hank Schrader custom. And another thing is, you can actually give Hank a bulletproof vest if you want to be accurate to when he's doing like DEA drug busts and stuff like that. But this is probably the least accurate custom in this entire video because I couldn't really find a good head for Hank, so I just decided to use this random Captain America head, so yeah, that's basically it for this custom. Now for the fourth custom in today's video, we have Tuco Salamanca. Now, the legs of this custom minifigure are just from like a random Lego City minifigure. Then, we're gonna attach this Ronald Weasley torso piece from Harry Potter, except I swapped out the hands so that they're accurate or the same color as the head that we're gonna be attaching, which is from a random Eternal minifigure from Eternals. And then for the last piece, we're gonna take this black hair piece, which is from a Sam Wilson Captain America minifigure, and then we have the completed Tuco custom. Now this Tuco custom is pretty basic, there's not much else to really talk about, so yeah, that's basically it. Now for the fifth and last custom in today's video, 
we have Hector Salamanca. Now, the legs of this ghost of minifigure are from the LEGO Volcano Explorer minifigure. Then, we're gonna attach this random Alfred torso piece, which is from the LEGO Batman movie minifigure series blind bags. Then, we're gonna take this vulture headpiece from Marvel, pop that on, and then for the last piece, we're gonna take this Alfred upper head or hair piece and we have the completed Hector custom but then we gotta put him in a wheelchair where he belongs and then we're also gonna give him his classic bell pop it in his hand and then we have the completed Hector custom ding 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 but anyway that's basically it for this video i hope you bros enjoyed these five breaking bad customs now breaking bad is actually my second favorite tv show of all time so that's why Regardless of if this video does well, it's probably not, I'm going to be honest, where I'm going to be showing some better Call Saul custom. So, stay tuned. Have a great day. Godspeed, bros.